the current A-Class was a big deal for Mercedes. After two generations of the clever but unlovable sandwich floor variety, Mercedes went mainstream with the third, aiming its crosshairs directly at the Audi A3 and BMW 1 Series. On sale since 2012, the third generation has been a sales success for Mercedes, but often came under scrutiny from journalists for its tough ride and Renault sourced engines, on lesser engined models anyway. Mercedes is hoping that this totally redesigned car addresses these issues while maintaining its sales momentum. Taking a majority of its design cues from the A-Class saloon concept, the new hatch looks to share the previous car's basic aesthetic, only this time adding a useful pinch of aggression alongside some updated design graphics rapidly being spread throughout the rest of the Mercedes passenger car range. Chief among the visual changes is a new downturned grille that first made its appearance on the facelift AMG GT. The new grille is now flanked by two slim lighting units that look like they have been taken straight off the A-Class saloon concept from earlier in 2017, albeit an entry-level halogen specification here expect fancier-looking LED units to feature on a majority of models in the UK. The flanks have a smoother profile than the current cars with the convening character lines giving way to more traditional detailing. The window line looks much the same though, as does the tail, save for some slimmer lights that now spread across onto the tailgate. The new tail lights will also address the issue of a narrow boot opening on the current car, an irritable side effect of the previous single-piece units. Bigger changes should be felt under the skin however as Mercedes has continued to refine the MFA platform. Majoring on improving boot space and refinement, the new A-Class should also hopefully finally be able to rival the BMW 1 Series for driving thrills. Mercedes has not given much away when it comes to drivetrains, although we expect a wide range of Mercedes-developed four and possibly even three-cylinder petrol and diesel engines. AMG has also had a big say in this car's development, with a new generation A45 AMG ready to retake its crown of being the most powerful hot hatch from the Audi RS3. Rumors also persist of a new, lower-powered A40 AMG version decent to rival less extreme, but higher-selling hot hatch rivals like the Audi S3 and Golf R. Peer behind the hatch in the pictures and you'll also see a saloon body style, which as the concept suggested will be available early in the A-Class model cycle. This does bring into question the likelihood of Mercedes ditching the CLA nomenclature, but we will have to wait and see. A new Gen Gla SUV and B-Class MPV are definite though, so expect to see them in due course too.